What's up guys? Welcome back to the UDive YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be telling you about the things you need to know and prepare for before you start Lent. Now a lot of people are going to be talking about Ash Wednesday and the whole Lenten season and everything you need to give up and some people will be saying they're not eating pizza and we get the point. People are giving up things but the first thing you need to realize about Lent is that it's not just about what you give up or what how you're going to punish yourself quote unquote. This is about a period that you're going to get better and better better and better until the end of Lent in Easter. Now the goal of this thing is to make you a better Christian and a better Catholic in general by the time Easter has come around and not just so you can brag and say I didn't eat pizza the whole of Lent, right? So the first thing you need to realize is that whatever it is that you're giving up has to be something that is going to make you a better Christian or better Catholic by the time you've given up that thing for an entire season of Lent. If you want to watch a video that I made about this same thing sometime last year when Lent came around, you can click and go watch it. It's very, very informative. The most important thing, however, that I want you to know for this year's Lent is that throughout the entire season of Lent, whatever it is that you choose to pick up or give up or anything that it is that you choose to do, the most important thing throughout this season of Lent is that you should learn how to pray. If you learn absolutely nothing this season of Lent, if you do not read a single word of scripture and shame on you shame on you if you don't read a single word of scripture but if you don't read a single word of scripture you don't open your bible you don't you don't do any other thing that is supposed to be religious i want you to say just one rosary every day during this lent right you don't even have to do any of those other things okay so all those other things that you're used to doing during lent i'm giving up sweets i'm giving up pizza i'm giving up whatever it is that you're giving up you can keep all of them this lent as long as you choose to do one rosary just one rosary a day and i guarantee you that by the time you go one rosary a day from ash wednesday to easter sunday you will notice that your catholicism your christianity in general is far far better than all the other lengths combined when all you were doing was giving up sweets and cakes and all those things right so just commit to yourself after you finish watching this video you can even Put it in the comments if you want um, accountability from other divers and just tell yourself, I commit to saying one rosary a day for the whole of Lenten season. Now, I know that there are many times that you may slip up. There are many times that you may forget. You may be too busy. But what is going to happen is that even though it may be too difficult for you to do at the beginning, let's say at... Um, the first week of Lent, by the time you enter the second week and by the time you enter the third week, you find out that you're significantly better, that you have more discipline, you have more strategies, you have a better way of overcoming all these um, temptations and obstacles and distractions and all those things that are preventing you. And by the time you come out of Lent, during one rosary a day, every single day for Lent, you will notice that your prayer life is significantly better. Now, isn't that a better goal to achieve than just giving up cakes for Lent and then picking back up cakes for Lent, right? So anything you want to do, you can leave it in the comments or you can go to the Facebook page or Instagram group anywhere and just commit to this and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.